On today's episode of Flashing Lights, join me as we head out in this Michigan State Police livery police car with the new custom lights update for yet another night patrol with some unexpected surprises. Let's go ahead, roll that intro, and get right into this patrol. All right, hullers. Hello and welcome back to Flashing Lights. It has been quite a while since I've not only played this game, but posted a video on the channel. Uh, I'm not going to talk about it a lot in this video, because obviously I want to focus on this and the game. I will talk about it later this week. Obviously, Idaho is coming for American Truck Sims. We will be going out and hitting the roads in American Truck Sim here pretty quick. And I will talk about where I've been, what's been happening if you are not in the loop. If you've missed out on any information, be sure to check out the Discord link in the description, or follow me on social media, at LonHullerGMG on Twitter, Snapchat, and Instagram. I don't really post on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter are the places to be for now. Hopefully down the road, more than that. But yeah, let's go ahead, let's jump into our Michigan State Police Patrol. Alright, so we are making our way up here. We've got a reported drunk driver. So we're going to make our way up towards this gas station and see if we can't see anybody coming down. This is where the report came in. It was just up here. We'll go ahead and we'll pull in. Actually, I want to go check out that van. I was confused. I was like, oh, that guy didn't stop. It's a, uh, a yield, so that checks out. Uh, the van seems to be long gone. So I don't know what the deal is there. We'll come up here into the hill a little bit and then come back down, see if we can't find anybody. Don't really see any uh, erratic driving or anything, so we'll just keep an eye out. But yeah, so obviously, this is my first time in the new update uh, since they added the customizable lights, which I must say, like I was not expecting them to drop it when they did, and it is amazing. Uh, obviously, there's a few changes, like the lights need to not cut through the car. So if I turn my beacon on tonight, you're going to see red inside the car, which kind of sucks in some ways, but that's okay. I am more than okay to make do for now. Obviously, they've got some work to be done, but I see them doing it pretty soon. And they did also release their roadmap. So coming up soon, we're going to have uh, color customization and a bunch of other stuff, and they're really just they're kicking ass. Shout out to the flashing lights devs, as always, these guys are doing really good. I say these guys, it's one guy as far as I know. So, shout out to them, you guys, you guy, I guess, whatever. <laughs> like, the game is really, really, really doing well for what it is, and uh, I'm definitely happy. But, this is also my first time ever doing mods. I have had people suggest it for quite a while, so I finally got myself set up, and we have our first mods in. I am running a skin pack that is the Michigan State skin pack so it's got like the Detroit police it's got Michigan State like we are running right now and stuff like that and I will get more into why I chose that here in just a minute we're actually gonna turn around we're gonna head back into town I'm gonna try and find a spot to stop so I can turn around and then I will talk to you guys in just a short few all right well I said we were gonna head back down but this guy seems to be all over the road I don't know what their deal are. Their deal are? Their deal is. Wow. That was the worst lapse in English I've had in a little bit. But I think once we get to a safer spot, I'm going to pull this dude over. See what he's got going on. Jeez. Bald head's so shiny, it's going to reflect back in my ass. Ah, uh, let's see here. I guess I'm just going to wait. I am kind of tailgating. I'm being a really crappy cop right now tailgating. I should not be doing that. This guy definitely knows he's getting stopped. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait till we're a little further down, pull him over, and then see you guys when we do that. Oh, this is not a good spot. I am going to try and adjust my car out a little bit. Now, the one thing about these cars, I did do some research on them. Uh, I'll talk about this more in just a short few. I want to make sure traffic gets by me before I hop out.
All right, we are all clear behind. I wish I could go over to the passenger side, but I don't think I can. Hopefully there's no funny business. How's it going today? Uh, let's see here. Can I get your license and registration, please? Horace Schmidt. All right, I'm going to go run his name. See if I can remember how to spell it, because I've already forgotten. Although it should autofill. So we should be okay on that front. All right, let's go ahead. Uh, we're going to search database. Horace Schmidt, see what he's got going on. Let's see here. Definitely legal age, no warrants, no wants, nothing like that. Seems like he's all good. So we're going to go give him back his ID and uh, get him breathalyzed because it does appear that he's under the influence. Let me make sure we are all clear to step out. Okay, we did have a car come by just as I got out, so that was kind of bad timing. All right, here's the license registration back. I want to go ahead and breathalyze you if you would be willing to submit. Otherwise, you have to go to the station. I do believe that's how that goes. Hmm. So he's .053, which, as far as I know, at least in the state that I'm in, I believe it's .08 is the limit. Uh, I don't know if it's, like, in here it's... Um, no tolerance, like zero tolerance. So I don't know if I'm actually supposed to take him in on this one. I know that each state differs, so maybe I'm, maybe it's different. Maybe there's federal levels or something. I know in my state he's technically under the the limit. So, based on actually, you know what? Give me two seconds. I'm gonna figure out what it is in Michigan. Okay, so. Uh, I was kind of right on both fronts, so the way that it works, at least according to their website, is .08 or greater if over the age of 21, which is what this guy is. So technically, he's not over the legal limit. He's fine to leave, uh, but it is also a zero tolerance, so you can't have pretty much any alcohol in your system if you're under 21. This guy is clearly over 21. Sorry, dude, I'm not calling you old. It's your birthday, but he is under the limit so i'm gonna let him go he is free to go which is the first time i've ever had that happen so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna release him he's free to go he can have a wonderful day and we're gonna try to not okay but then you do that okay no <laughs> no no not having it oh shut your door shut your door shut your door shut your door oh boy yeah, we're not having that. If I can go catch him, I'm going to go catch him, and then we'll go from there. Oh, my God. What are you doing? What are you doing? All right. That's... <laughs> you did not. You did not. You did not just do that right in front of me. All right. This guy's going in. I think I have to take them in anyways. Yeah, he's still definitely impaired. I can't get behind him to pull him over, though. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. You can do it. You can do it. No. No. Are we... Really? Does this look like a safe spot to pull over, sir? Oh, boy. All right. I'm gonna... I'm gonna actually tell him he's free to go, and then... Wait, what? Hello? Have you put on a disguise? That's not... Who are... None of these people. What? I'm... Whoa, God. Okay. Well, I guess you're a different driver. I'm gonna tell them they're free to go. And then pull them over again. Hopefully that'll trigger them to pull to the side. Alright, much better. Now we can step out. I don't know if this is the same person. We're going to ask for their license. I don't think it's the same person. Leela Fletcher. All right, I'm not even going to run their name real quick. I am just going to test them for alcohol. Really? You're just a really poor driver. Wow. All right, so let me check her real quick. And if she has no wants or warrants, she's free to go too. I think I was probably supposed to arrest the other guy. I don't think I can get around that one. Let's go ahead and let's check her out real quick. Leela Fletcher. No warrants, no wants. 
1976, clearly overage. She's not drinking anyway, so she's fine. I don't know. I don't know what her deal is and why she's driving like that, but I'm going to cite her for reckless driving. But I'm going to cite her for reckless driving if I can, because that was some... You literally passed him. That's just ridiculous, ma'am. Uh, let's see here. Verdict. Here's what we want. We want verdict. Traffic ticket. Uh, violation is going to be... I'll give her speeding because... Really? Can I not give her a ticket for reckless driving? Oh. I don't like having just let her go. I couldn't cite her for reckless... What is it with people? Can nobody drive tonight? Also, I do gotta say, like... So, what I wanted to talk about with this car is it's one of the most divisive cars, I think, in law enforcement, in terms of you either love it or you hate it. I have mixed feelings on it. It's kind of like, it's really cool seeing it stick with tradition, like this kind of style with the bubble. I think it's called a bubble light, is how they call it. But it's definitely an interesting, interesting look, for sure, especially with the new LED ones. But yeah, we're going to go ahead, get back in the car, go out on patrol, see what we can find, and go from there. I think we still have a drunk driver on the loose, so... Probably going to be more of that for a little bit. But I will see you guys shortly. Alright, so I've just pulled over this van here. Seemed like they were a little bit all over the road. We're going to walk up. Actually, I don't want to walk across in front of the vehicle, so we're just going to keep walking up on this side. How's it going today, sir? How are you doing? Go ahead and can I get your license registration, please? Eddie Nash. Awesome. Thank you, sir. We'll go ahead and run his name real quick just to be sure he's all good. He was all over the road, so I'm going to breathalyze him. There was a, a few spots that he kind of ran over the curb back behind. A little bit just strange driving. All clear on everything, well over 21, so if he is drinking and he's under the legal limit, he is fine. I'm pretty sure I was supposed to arrest the first guy I stopped. I do wish one thing they added in in here was the ability to cancel a call, even if it, were me if it means you lose points. So I went to give that uh, previous driver a... <laughs> Thank you, Ubisoft. I went to give that previous driver a citation for reckless driving, couldn't do that, so I tried to give him a citation for something else and lost points because it was not something they had actually done wrong, which makes sense. But I would love to see them add in little features like new things that you can charge people for. I feel like I'm, I should stop him. Uh, can I get out? Is it safe? But yeah, we'll go ahead, we'll breathalyze this guy. If he is all clear on that, then he will be good to go. Go ahead and breathalyze. 0.43. Technically, still legal. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know if it's supposed to be zero tolerance or what. I'm assuming because I got points there that it's supposed to be that he's supposed to be arrested and brought in. So, I don't think I'm going to make the same mistake I did with the other guy. I should have just arrested him. I think we're just going to take this guy in, see if it finishes up the call, and if it doesn't, then that's just going to confuse me even more. But, sorry dude, that means you're going to have to step out, please, and thank you. You are being arrested. Or, ooh, that is not what you want to say. You are being placed under arrest for suspected D... Would it be suspected DUI? Or would it be confirmed by this point? Because obviously he is technically under the influence. So we're going to go ahead, grab him, throw him in the back. We'll get a tow truck for his van. I'm going to put him in the opposite side so that I can see him. I don't know if that's a common practice. Or if they try to keep them on the same side so if something happens they can pull over and get to them faster. I don't know how that works. My thought process is if you're going to look over your right shoulder towards them, then you want to be able to see them. 
which is why I put them over there. We're going to step over here on the sidewalk and wait for the tow truck to arrive. And then we will get back to the station and see what are you doing. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Ma'am. What is your deal? I want you to stop here just for a quick second. Are you are you parking? Oh, look at that. That's pretty sick. Are you parking? What's your deal? Hmm? Why don't you go on about your business? This is dangerous. Please don't run me over. Alright, that has been taken care of. Oh, I wonder if the AI was pulling over early for that. Oops. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's totally what you want to do. Nice one, lady. Oh, Jesus. Someone just hit the tow truck. Alright, well, let's get out of here. Alright, so we have brought him in. And it did not clear the call. That was not our drunk driver. So if they are under 0 .08, we are letting them go. We're looking for somebody over that. And they're still out there. And why do we have copy and paste three of these dudes? What the? Interesting. Well, yeah, so apparently we have to get back out there and keep looking because he was not our guy. I totally also did not completely forget to frisk him <laughs> before bringing him in. That was a good voice crack, too. Definitely all going well. I am the most professional police officer in this city. I guess it'd be a state trooper, right? But nevertheless, let's go ahead. Let's get back out there and see that guy's wasted. See if we can find a driver that's wasted. Okay. This lady just ran a red. Seems to be all over the place, so as soon as we get around the corner, I am going to blip her, get her to stop. Probably should have waited at the light, but I didn't know if I was going to make this one. Oh, and of course that guy is drunk. And yeah, obviously you guys can see the light is in the cabin. Oh, yeah, uh-huh, this lady... Hmm, alright, we're going to stop them. Go ahead and pull over. I don't think you understand what the meaning is. Excuse me? Okay, if these people weren't driving so crap, you would 100% be getting pulled over for that. Alright. Alright, I'm going to tell them they're free to go and then I'm going to re-pull them over because this is not the ideal spot. So, joke's on you. You're not actually free to go. I'm going to pull you over again. Go, go, go. Mmm. Mmm. That's a unique way to take a turn like that. Oh, please don't hit this lady. Oh, jeez. What? That's how squirrels get run over. They, like, walk, they run across the road and then immediately just run back. What are you do? Jesus. What is happening? Whoa. Okay, the AI never ceases to amaze me in this game. This lady is definitely... Definitely having a night, to say the least. So we'll get them stopped. See if we can get them out. Riding the double. Pull over this time. No, don't sit in the middle of the road. Don't hit this car either. Okay. Okay, we're gonna do that. Anyone wanna explain to me what the hell is happening tonight? Where are you going? Jeez, alright. Are you are you drunk, lady? I'm just not, I'm not even gonna like ask the cop questions. Just gonna be like, well, give me your stuff, thank you. <laughs> I'm, I'm, this is, this is one of those nights that makes you wonder why you do this. <laughs> what is happening? Alright, let's jump in here. Alright, let's run their name, see what they got here. Rosemary Wood. One arrest, no wants, no warrants. 83, definitely legal. So, there's that much. Oh, this is going to be a fun one.
Honestly, I hope this is the drunk person, because this is the most elusive drunk driver I've ever had. Alright, so, I've never wanted a drunk driver before. I just realized that's, that's a weird, that's a weird thing. Please be drunk. What? There's no way! How? Yeah. Oh, what? Okay. There's no way. Really? Can I do it again? Yeah, she's clean. I'll be damned. I don't know what to do with this. I guess I have to let her go too. What is happening? Alright, well, this is the most elusive drunk driver I've ever had. So, we're gonna let her go. She's, she's good. Oh, man. I shouldn't be between the two of them, but I don't want to get hit. Are you going? Or do I need to tell you you can leave again? What are you doing? You leaving or what? You free to go? Yeah, I can't do anything. She's on her own now. Uh, what do you think you're doing, sir? Can I help you? Are you keying my car? Oh, okay. Just checking. Alright, let's get out of here. Well, folks, I think I'm just gonna have to call this one where it's at, because I've pulled over everyone that I've suspected so far, and no one's had any sort of alcohol in their system, or anything like that, and for some reason, a lot of the AI has started to uh, glitch out, so they'll be driving by me on a traffic stop and then just drive off into Neverland. One guy that I pulled over ended up in the ditch with his wheels running, and, uh, yeah, so I think that elusive drunk driver is gonna get away tonight. I think we're just gonna have to call that where it is. So thank you guys, as always, for watching. Like I said in the beginning of the video, if you want the most up-to-date information on me, what I'm doing, all the stuff I'm working on, or further videos, Follow me on social media. Excuse me? Hello? You wanna maybe not? Okay, hold on. This is, this is, this is... I don't know what this deal is. What? 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 Whoa, pursuit, pursuit, <laughs> pursuit. Whoa, stroke. Hold up, hold up. He's running, he's running. Whoa, okay. Stop the vehicle, come on. Alright, this is, I was supposed to be stopping, bro. You're supposed to be stopping. Oh, yes. No, 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 box him in. Box him, box him, box him. No, 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 brakes, 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 brakes. Stop it. Oh no, lights. I need my lights. Shoot. Get out, get out, get out. Get out. Step out. Step out. Step out. Out of the vehicle. Out of the vehicle. Out of the vehicle. Where'd she go? Out. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Nope. You're not running from me, you drunk. No. Oh, your leg's broken, ma'am. Ma'am, your leg's broken. Stop. Jeez. What are the odds, dude? That's one way to make yourself known. I swear to God I didn't plan any of that. Alright. We're gonna take this person in. I think this might be the drunk driver. Oh, uh... What? <laughs> I don't know if you know where you're going, dude. Oh no, I guess they can come in there. Didn't know that. Alright. You're gonna come over here. I'm gonna shut my door. Oh, and then get run over. I'm sorry. Let me alone. That was a horrible idea to just leave them standing here. I forgot to cuff them and stuff. I'm the worst cop. That's not what I wanted. Alright. We're gonna go ahead and handcuff her. I mean, there's no doubt going to jail, especially for running like that. First, we're gonna frisk her. Make sure she's all clean. She's got a bottle on her, we know. Just an ID card. Alcohol. Yup, this is her. Okay, so here it says alcohol over the .08 limit. So that is our limit. So I was correct in letting the other one at the beginning go. I brought the second guy in. I shouldn't have done that. 
But what are you doing? That's kind of creepy. Can I, can I, you look possessed, bro. He's like, eyes are rolling back in his head. What? What do you want? There's like this one demon guy that comes out every single time. This is not the first time he's been out here. What do you, yeah, go about your business, dude. God, that's terrifying. Okay. So, uh, we're going to ask for her ID, Sherry McBride. We're going to place her in my vehicle. Hopefully she does not throw up in the back seat because she's so wasted. Oh, man. All right. Well, so much for ending it. That's one way to do it. I will, uh, we'll get back to that in a second. Damn. Dude, you can't make this up. That was like, that's like the perfect timing ever. Just rear-ended me right on time. All right. Put my lights on because they're supposed to be on. No, I don't want to get out. All right. We're going to do two things. First, we're going to search her up, see what she's got. Valid license, four violations, two parking tickets, and one arrest. Dude, you need to chill. Oh my. Alright, we're gonna scan the van. That's a weird thing to say. Resume, pause, resume, don't know how that works. Okay, well I guess we've scanned it, so now I should be able to search. We're gonna autofill you. Not stolen, valid insurance, active registration, all clean on that. So the van comes back all clean and clear. She, however, very much does not. So we're going to hop out real quick if it is safe. Looks like we've had a little bit of a fender bender. Probably people rubbernecking. Don't do that when you pass the car accident or anything like that. We're going to go ahead and get the vehicle towed. Hop back in. Transport this person. There's a tow truck right there. Oh, man. The timing on that was impeccable. You cannot make that up. That was so good. I mean, I didn't even... Like, I spent the whole night chasing her. It's literally been an hour. It's literally been an hour. You guys won't see an hour-long video, but it's been an hour for me of trying to find this person. And at the last second, they popped in. Thank you. All right. And we are off. Thank God. What is this? What is this? That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Yeah, I definitely need to park up for the night because I am... I'm going to be glad to get off of this shift. Jeez. All right. Well, that was the longest drive back to the police station ever. What is it with these parking spaces? I can never get them right. Look at how horrible that is. All right, let's get her out. Let's get her booked. Excuse me, step out, please. We will do this. And bring her back. She probably needs to get her leg checked out. That did not look too healthy. But yeah, oh man, that was... That went from zero to a hundred real quick. Man not expecting that oh sorry ma'am just smashed her face off the glass because I wasn't paying attention absolute professional please tell me this is her Sherry McBride hey there we go suspect neutralized so we did finally catch her oh my god but yeah thank you guys again for watching this is the actual end of the video do go ahead and stick around at the end I always have an outro which you can find the playlist to this series if you would like to see more and you have not already. Definitely check that out. And it also will show you a random video from my channel so you can see potentially what YouTube thinks the best video on my channel is for you to check out next. So definitely wait till the end. And uh, yeah, all that fun stuff. Find me on social media at LawnHollerGMG on Snapchat, Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, and TikTok. Let's see how that one goes, see if it gets taken down or not. Don't think it will, but I do use TikTok. Uh, not frequently on Instagram, TikTok, that sort of thing, but trying my best. I am back, finally. I did take some time, but I am back. And uh, hopefully, the future is bright. But yeah, thanks again for watching, and I will see you guys in the next patrol. Peace.